Hi, I'm Leo, um, Creative Director and Partner here at Canal. Hi, my name is Hugo and I'm also a partner and a creative director here at Gazelle. So we are like in our office, we have two rooms. Here is the, the first one where we have like the, it's like it's a mix between the meeting room and the, the little kitchenette. Here is a bookshelf where we showcase some of our favorite projects. And here's the second space of the office where the working space are. There's Lea, Etienne, Audrey, Gabrielle, and Marianne. LG2 is the largest independent creative agency in Canada, with a dozen areas of expertise across its three offices. But how can we facilitate our talent's daily collaboration? This is one of the questions we asked ourselves when building our Montreal headquarters in the Technopolangus. Welcome to LG2. This is the café where our baristas work to keep us fueled every day from 9 to 5. Our stairs serve as a gathering space and are perfect for informal meetings or for sipping lattes. As you can see, this floor offers the ultimate open concept area. While in this silent room, people can work in peace or take a little afternoon nap. This is where the creative director in residence spends their afternoon. They're entirely devoted to bouncing around ideas with creatives. We recently reworked the way in which LG2's area of expertise collaborate. Now, more and more projects involve branding and design, the digital experience group, and architecture. Meaning a ton of projects are thought through from A to Z, from their logos, to their website, to their place in the world. And there's our famous terrace. Let's just say that it's a lot more lively when it's warm out. We knew we wanted to give back to the neighborhood that welcomed us. That's why we worked on the branding and signage for Technopolangus. And more recently on the new Annette wine bar located in our building. Pretty sweet location, right? Welcome to C5M Studio Crawl. I'm Ash, co-founder of C5M, and I'm here with Miro, co-founder of C5M. We're very privileged to be able to work fully remotely. A lot of our clients and our collaborators, you know, they all work remotely as well. So we spend most of our days in this office, having our virtual meetings. A little bit about our agency. We are a strategic design agency and so we specialize in branding and helping companies define and express who they are. This corner right here is dedicated to my graphic novels. When I get bored, I kind of just flip through them just to get a little inspired. We also have a lot of artwork and photos of ourselves. We are not narcissists, I promise, on the walls. This is some old art we did. This is a naked dude that I drew in college. And this is the Low End Theory album artwork painted by my amazing sister right above a piano that doesn't get played as often as it should. And right here we have our affirmation board that we look at every morning just to set the tone for the day. Two of our collaborators, Sushi and Soya, who often interrupt most of our meetings, throwing up to show some love here. <laughs> so yeah, we usually start our days at 9 a.m. and then by 12 p.m., you know, it's our lunch break. So we take the time to, you know, I make my smoothie, Ash makes her amazing bowl, and we take this moment to kind of just decompress and relax pretty much as you can see our days are 
designed to be pretty laid back and that's intentional because we want to redefine what it means to have an agency and redefine agency culture in general and one of the reasons our agency was created was to really fill a gap and bring in something new because we noticed a very large um, lack of diversity within our industry and we wanted to uh, be that representation that we were looking for when we first came in and we want to encourage more diverse creatives to join and take up space within our industry and that's the space that we're trying to create um, within our agency. Anyway, thank you for taking the time to join us. This sums up our studio crawl and we really just wanted to showcase that it doesn't take much to start an agency. It's very digital and you, you can use us as an example. We're working from home and yet we're doing amazing work, working with amazing clients and amazing people. And if you want to start an agency, you can do it from the comfort of your own home as well. So don't let that stop you.